Hello and welcome to the podcast. Hello and happy Monday. Happy Monday. <laughs> Is it not Monday? Did you think it was Monday? I was about to go Mother's Day, but a Monday. Monday. Lauren's getting up me about booking appointments. Oh, are you bad at that? Yes. Yeah, well, you are. Your tooth, has it been pulled out yet? <clears throat> well, it's, I've got to get the MRI. But um, also, you're not good at just moving on from things sometimes. You're like, oh, no, because we forgot this appointment for the kid. I'm like, yeah, but you've said that for a week. Like, it's time to forgive I yourself just, for it's, forgetting it's a, one appointment. I know, it's life admin. And I've just had a lot build up. I know, but this thing that you're not booking is going to make you feel better. It's This is sounding far more dramatic. It's about his tooth, right? No, and the like, tooth's gone. It's a, well, like it's, it's a, still an they, ongoing sign. Is there an the infection? Tooth. No, well, he doesn't know. It could be an infection. Freaking appointment. It could in the sinus. Septic. Or exactly. like there could be a piece of tooth lodged up in my sinus. So my advice was. If you look after yourself and feel better, then you'll be better for your family. When I get a bit stressed, when I get a bit stressed, my left side of my face swells up, which and is I, every day. And I take four neurofin to take the edge off, which is not healthy. Mm. No, but just go and do it because you, you'll be a punish to the family because you'll be short and you'll be irritated. Because I'm you're anything not but a well. punish to the family right now. Question: well, Can we bring Sarah McGilvray in for the? I don't think she likes. I don't that. know if she'd want to, but uh, Mason Cox is here. Oh, means, you can. Should we get Coxie in? No, 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 Sarah. Sarah, have you got a second? Mason. This is our fearless leader. Mason um, can come in too. Can you say hello to the podcast? This is our I fearless said, I don't leader. Think Sarah would like Sarah. Me. Hi guys. Hello, Sarah. I don't know if I'm allowed to be on podcast. You are yes, absolutely. You are. Oh, well, especially okay. now. Oh, okay. Well, well thanks you're for the boss. coming in to say hi. <laughs> I know. Oh, sort of not really. Okay. Um, hi guys. Hello. Hi. <laughs> Good to see you all. I haven't even come and said hello. How about us having having a little flirt with um with Mason. a very good-looking footballer out there? Yeah. So you're worried about jumping on a podcast, but you're happy to say you're flirting with the guests. Yeah. Well, he knows. It. Well, he's not listening. I look out, and he's really not paying attention. No, oh, says, there he is. from Sydney. She's left the husband and kids at home, so yes. let her do whatever she wants. You live. You bet. When your husband's like, how was Melbourne? You can be like, well, I was flirting with footballers <laughs> and just <laughs> staying in fancy hotels. Do you know that I did hear you this morning, just a little bit of on-air feedback, guys. Okay. Oh, um, oh, you, oh, you, were making, go. you were having a go at a caller for being a Bombers fan. Yeah, My house is all oh, Bombers gear. My husband's a My bomber. husband is a die-hard Bombers uh, fan, and you were saying no, no to a caller. But also, can that's I just right. say that's that a, was your a... biggest issue with that call? We were trying to set a sixty-five-year-old <laughs> grandmother up with a twenty-five-year-old, and the problem with the content. I Is that I had to go on a bomber's fan? I think she was sixty-three. Actually, yeah, exactly. <laughs> she was a bit young. But I'm glad we're focusing on the right issue. <laughs> yeah, that's right. No, I thought she was really cute. The girl. Oh, do you want other feedback on today's show? Oh, yeah. mm. Didn't ask, but no, by all means. Yeah. <laughs> no. What did no. we do wrong? You're doing well, guys. Doing really well. Keep it up. Smile in your voices. You know. Compliment sandwich. Coming, all right, so we've had About the good. a fist away from the mic, is that the... Yeah, yeah. great. No, no, I got nothing. Any You've negative stuff from today? We'll talk about it after. Oh, okay. Let's not do it. We don't, you don't do it in public. I take you aside. Was it my tone deaf singing? Anyway, yeah. I'm off to <laughs> Channel 9 now. I'm just going to stay on the podcast all tomorrow morning. It's the only safe space. Got us in trouble again, a marathon? Do you, a reckon, marathon? Do, you reckon, do you want to do a marathon? Oh, fuck no. <laughs> There's no way on earth. I don't want to run a marathon. I don't want to do a marathon radio show. What would you do? Would you run a marathon before you did a radio marathon? Probably. <laughs> what about if you had to pick one or the other? I, w- I would go and live in another country. <laughs> did you run that marathon that blocked all the traffic in Melbourne yesterday? The, no, that's the Mother's Day Classic, which is a big fundraiser for oh. ovarian cancer and breast cancer research. Sorry it caused event. you traffic dramas. One of <laughs> Melbourne's did. best events. It did. I was trying to get to lunch and I got stuck. Oh, yeah. Oh. Yeah, no, Odd that's a rookie road. era. Oh. Mother's Day, you don't drive in no, no near St Kilda mm. Road or Less the town. No, listen, listen. Mm. Anyway, here I am feeling sorry for you. Do you know you what, jumped Sarah? on a 6 a.m. flight, that's but you've been down for the weekend. I did. I flew home last night because one of my kids threw up all through the hotel room, so oh. we had to get out of there real hang fast. Hang on, hang on. Are you taking the piss? No. So why not? is the whole family here? No, no, no. I took them all home last night, put everyone to bed, did a grocery shop, got all the school clothes ready, and then I got back on the plane this morning and flew. Hang on. Someone's getting their frequent flights. So you, <laughs> Someone's you, angling for you European were, summer. <laughs> in Melbourne with the family for the weekend? I was. But the children were sick, so they went home. Well, that meant that I couldn't do anything other than be mm. stuck in a hotel room. Yeah. So... You flew them all home and then came back. I did. That's You're how much I mom. love you guys. <laughs> no, you just wanted to get away from the sick kid. <laughs> Maybe that too. I'm, if, if I was the mother, I would have sent them on the plane on their own. See no, ya. you wouldn't have. They would have been with the help. <laughs> See ya. <laughs> Question. I thought about it. Yeah. When you landed back in Sydney, did you go back to the house with them? 
Yeah, yeah I put them she to bed. Or just going to the lounge. Yeah, I had to go to the supermarket, do a shop, because, you know, you never have food after a weekend away. <sighs> You're a good mom. And That's then, good. That's yeah, you did all of that on your Mother's Day. Happy Mother's Day, by the oh, way. Happy Mother's you. Day. Happy Mother's Day, Sarah. Thanks, guys. Did you get some shitty present from the Mother's mum. Day stall? Uh, no, one of my kids, you know how they do at school, like, a photo with something they've written oh, on, like, yeah. what that I love about my mum? We were about it this morning. Yeah, so mine wrote, I love riding my scooter with my mum. And I looked at her, I said, you don't own a scooter, buddy. What's all that about? I said that this morning they just make things up. <laughs> How good is it? Yeah, my dad likes us. wine. Why say that stuff? <laughs> Jacinta, <laughs> Jacinta Campbell, Jacinta Franklin put up one from her son and it said, my mum is, and he wrote, 64 years old. <laughs> like That's how she, she feels. Good. Wow. 64. Doesn't she? I said she um, looks great. Can it stop raining in Sydney, by the way? Oh, tell me like, about seriously. it. seriously. I got home and my front veranda had buckled and the wood has pushed up the front. What? No, I, no, I was so like, wet. Yeah, I was like, what's going on Guys, here? I landed Friday, what, six? By the way, missed me flight. Why'd you miss your flight? Oh. It was a four oh. flight. No. Oh, from, I, the, from the Mother's Day I lunch? I thought I was booked on a 4.15. <clears throat> I was booked on a 3.15. Oh. We left at 2.30. Yeah, Not I did. me. Oh, you were I never going to make that. I was there with the mums, <clears throat> dancing with them all, it taking photos. Beautiful. All the boys It was amazing. It was a beautiful there. event. Mm, May Stog really did good. very, very well. Oh, well yes, done, lovely. Miss. Good yeah. vibes. Great vibes. Anyway. A couple of the mums wanted a little bit of dessert. The fun started after they left. Did it? The fun started after you two left. Those what were those porn, porn star martinis? They, they were, were delicious good. passion fruit martinis. Did anybody get a bit uh, happy? Yeah, they were having a wow of a time. Did you see Liz? I had her decked out in her Nova merch. I was taking all the table decorating flowers <laughs> for our Mother's Day lunch. <laughs> Have you not seen this video? Was there a um, after party? Uh, no. Was the crowd like still there at three pumping? Yeah, yeah. No, a lot I had to go to school pick up. Hang on, where's I had Liz? to go and do school pick up because Lou was on a bender. She is. Look at. <laughs> this is your mum. This is my mum. Oh. oh my god. <laughs> Wait for it. Floral and my heart's full listening to Anthony and Tim. Couldn't ask for a better start to a Mother's Day. They were great. <laughs> Thank you, Nova. Love ya. <laughs> Love ya. <laughs> Thank you, Nova. <laughs> Sounds quite. Thank you, oh, Nova. Not Love slurring. Ya. No, so no, no, no. She was well she behaved. She, she, well she well cried behaved. during Anthony Collier, though. She didn't wear the leather pants. No, was because we teased her. I told her you'd called her leather pant Liz. <laughs> so you can't pick know. on other people's mums. That's leather a Liz. real I low didn't. point. No, I didn't. She she said, oh, I'm going to wear leather pants. And I said, let's call her le- 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 leather Liz. <laughs> <laughs> le- leathery Liz. <laughs> She's gorged by mum. She's yeah. very beautiful. Look, absolutely. absolutely nothing like me. Oh, stop. <clears throat> I, absolute opposites. When I do my Instagram stalking of you, you have very good looking family members. Yeah, I don't look like any of them. Oh, that's rubbish. They're all blonde haired, blue eyed, and I'm this little brown child. <laughs> Do you reckon Liz had a little fun somewhere? Potentially. Okay. I'm more like dad than mum, though, to be honest, so I don't think so. Yeah, right. No, no, no. I'm definitely my You are lucky, dad. You know, her dad comes to our events just to see me. She wasn't even there. He just popped down. He turned up for Say Hey to 10K. Jace got there before me, and then at the end, Jace goes, Oh, I saw your dad before. I'm like, No, it couldn't have been my dad. He goes, Yeah, your dad was here. Dad arrived, (laughs) took a photo with Jace. And left. Didn't even say hello to me. That's weird. Didn't isn't wait it? for me. Well, I was running Love 10 you, minutes, Bobby. 15 minutes late. So he didn't even wait for me. He just took off. Your dad's very good on air, though, isn't he? You guys had him on yeah, a little while ago. Yeah, very strong. Very strong. Very strong. Yeah. 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 We're going to take him to the Logies. Oh, yeah. He did Are all our red carpet interviews once upon a time. Are we going, is that confirmed? Are we going to the Logies? Uh, I think you might be. Are you up for something, Clint Stanaway? Yeah, best new talent. Yes. Are you? No, I'm not. <laughs> oh, right. I was going to say, gonna... haven't you done your job for quite a while? 23 years. Mature? Exactly. Are you up for something? No, 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 no. Oh. Maybe weekend today is best weekend news program. <laughs> We've been getting it's you in for the radio awards, though. You you guys qualify by about twenty days. Do oh, really? yeah, yeah. Great. Oh, what our content in the radio awards? It, it, Nova, your time with us qualifies Perfect. by about twenty days. We can so within so does that, that twenty mean days. We're just allowed to attend, or you can nominate us for some no, no, of our brilliant content. No, no, <laughs> we've nominated you, but we can only for use what? the audio from about. 15 oh. shows, oh. something, yeah. Do what we, have you nominated um, us How about for? Best what? News Route? <laughs> we were hoping we might win something for the other mob and then we could get up and protest. <laughs> I don't know if they'll enter our applications for you, Liz. Oh, you so can w- enter yourself. We can can we enter, enter ourselves? ourselves with audio from the other mob? Yeah, or we can. they have to do it? Um, guys, a little bit on the nose to get up and win for somebody else. <laughs> no, we wouldn't be winning for them. We'd be winning for <clears> us. And we shot. were going to get up like Merlin in Big Brother and hold oh, up. Tape the, your mouths. Yeah, tape yeah. our mouths <laughs> and hold up the protests. <laughs> 
<laughs> I'm going to escalate this request. Hey, I don't feel like I can answer. Me as Merlin at the Acres might be safer. That's a great idea. The last you year. were like yeah. Merlin anyway. Yeah. You were so nervous you basically taped your mouth shut last year anyway. Yeah. Clean on anyway. the red carpet. Were you right? sloppy? No, I was sloppy. Oh, I'm on the way in, I come he, yeah. from the races. We had to ask him not to speak <laughs> on the red carpet. Awesome. I didn't have any trouble doing that. <laughs> It was a mute. <laughs> because I couldn't speak. <laughs> he was like, I think I should just stand here and smile. And he just but he left like early, time. which is a shame because he was on. Yeah. Yeah, a little um, hand holding and everything. Anyway, we so been on best that news night. reader, so we're going for that. Yeah, yeah, we'll talk about that afterwards. Yeah. When, I, when I give you your air check notes. Oh, I can't I'm wait. do that one then. <laughs> can't wait for that. I reckon uh, the industry would walk out if you want best. Where is the these at Radio Awards? Sydney, Sydney Industries again. cooked. Mm. Yeah. Is what? Sydney, Sydney, Sydney two years in a row? Well, they sign... Uh, like a three or five year deal with a venue each oh. time. But with it's year on, year off, year on, year off. You obviously haven't been in a while. They do chunks now, like two, three, oh. and that's because that's well, what that's you sign good for on. Clint, because mm. it means you would be able yeah, to attend because you have a weekend today. And Chase, you like it when it's a little out of town. Oh, it's town. very inconvenient. <laughs> yeah. um, and I. And we have to we go up on the Friday. We don't have to do anything, though, do we? Unconfirmed. What, what are we open to? Nothing. Skits and things? No, absolutely, absolutely not. I'll turn not. up and that's it. I feel like you could do a skit, though, like. No. no. <laughs> Sarah, I'm, I'm like, I sometimes in... say no and it means, like, like, a bit of massaging and I could be convinced. This yeah. is like a, like I'd rather run a marathon. How about a skit involving bald heads? It's well, been can... done. <laughs> I was going to say, was that last year's skit? Yeah. I don't reckon we need it to do it again. O- 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 fest. We, it? um... Yeah, so it's a hard no from you? Hard no. But Tim, you two could Tim do did a Tim did a music quiz one year, I think. I don't know, mate. Yeah. I, I only go over Do you go? Sometimes, yeah. Do we have to go? Yes, it it's depe- a good night. Do you know what? It depends how much Last I like was... you as to whether I force you to come just to sit with me so that I get oh, through the night. i sit with you. Well, it's oh, funny because you, last yes. year we got whacked on a, an odds and eds table. Oh, yeah. And that's yeah. when we knew the writing was on the wall. <laughs> <laughs> we were basically sitting when we're on the, the bastard. distant oh. cousins table. Yeah, we were like, what okay. And no one said hello to us. We walked in and sat at that table and no one said hello to us. And we were like, is anyone from Kiss? Oh, no, I say, is anyone from the old, the current company here? And we looked around and I was like, oh, everyone's here. Oh, they're all sitting together. Oh, no one's saying hello. Oh, that's terrible, guys. No, we wouldn't do that to you. No. You can't oh, no. sit with us. You can't do that because you're not getting rid of us. <laughs> <laughs> You've only just avoided us. Now, well, last year, though, I did know that we had a table up the back where, as you say, some odds and ends were shoved. Oh. But they weren't getting fired. They were just placed up the back. So yeah. I'll make sure you're up the front with Perfect. us this time. Thanks for bringing yeah, up no, those I memories. Remember, I actually <laughs> no. remember someone in marketing or events mm. being like, Someone's just through, sent through a list of the tables and they've moved you guys onto some separate random table. And yeah. I was like, oh, that'll do. Yep. Getting you want me, fired I'll be... sucks, doesn't it? But yeah. <laughs> it's I'm a that low note. point. Okay, Not all right. when you get rehired here. <laughs> That's all right. It's the best thing that ever happened to us, sir. <laughs> Anyway, oh. this podcast should probably never be put no, in. No, 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 we're fine, we're fine. Just edit me out of it. That'd be great. It's the whole thing. There's <laughs> only one minute without you. We're right on the line. Good to see you, Seth. Yeah, thanks, we guys. We love you. Love we'll come you in too. for We do love you, Seth. I, I look forward to getting guys. a full um, lecture on how I'm no longer allowed to sing on the radio. <laughs> no, you'll be fine. Although our boss once told me I wasn't allowed to sing on air and for about eight years it was a, every time it happened a text stopped. Right now, who was that? BT. Yeah, he he actually declared it to the office that I was not allowed to. <laughs> so I'm saying to you, you are fine. You were actually oh no, sort no. of out of tune, but I was really impressed with the accuracy of the lyrics. It was pretty good. Yeah, oh, who knows all those footy songs? Sort sort of out of tune was nice. <laughs> I couldn't. That get was right polite. E, could I? <laughs> I didn't want to say that. Not yeah. even close. <laughs> all right, that's it. We're out of here. We are. Ciao, guys. Ciao, Have a good Monday. Have a lovely day. We'll see you tomorrow.